guys. Thank you for uh, We're going to start the panel. First of all, sorry for the very late start. But welcome to the official Spike Chunsoft and Uchikoshi panel. <laughs> so, before we get to the man of the hour, let's introduce ourselves. My name is Ari, and I'm PR marketing here at Spike Chunsoft. <laughs> and I'm Alex. I'm the localization supervisor as well as the lead editor. Alex is the man, he's the boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Here we go. So, this is our very first anime expo. Can you believe that? Yeah. I bet they can. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I bet you can from based, what's yeah, happening. Based on that, I bet they can. It's our first time. Give us, you know, give us a break. Yes. We love you. Thank you. <laughs> so for those of you who don't really quite know what Spike Tunes Off is doing over here in the West, we wanted to give you a quick recap on all of our titles. Starting with a trailer for our Pixel Drunk Monsters 2. And you'll have to be quiet to listen to these trailers, please. <laughs> Pixel Drunk Monsters 2 is coming, oh, it, actually it's out, it's, it's out. out, and that Danganronpa DLC that you all were laughing at, thank you very much for doing that, <laughs> is already out, it came out Just on the 3rd, yeah, yep. so it's out for Switch, Steam, PlayStation 4, come and get it. Yeah. Next, we also have Fire Pro Wrestling World, and we have a very special, oh, thank you, yeah! yeah. Fire Pro Wrestling game, huh? I got this. Kenny Omega starting out strong. An elbow to the face. Omega won't take this sitting down in a low blow. He'll be feeling that tomorrow. This can't be good. It looks like a devastating pile driver. Not like. Is this lights out for Omega? Kenny, but wait. That's out. Kota Ibushi's at the ropes. That's it. Begging Kenny to tag it in. Turn your living room into a ring with Fire Pro Wrestling World. <laughs> Fight alongside and against your favorite New Japan Pro Wrestling talent in the all-new scenario mode. Edit custom wrestlers, title belts, and more to book your dream match. Then, share your creations online and battle with players from around the globe. Go ahead, Trigger! Who do you have in your corner? Tag a friend. 
We'll see you in the ring. Fire Pro Wrestling World, available August 28th. Yes, that is available August 28th for PlayStation 4, and it does include that New Japan Pro Wrestling collaboration featuring wrestlers like Kenny Omega and Kota Ibushi, so you can play as the Golden Lovers. <laughs> and we do have a bonus New Japan Pro Wrestling Almanac that comes out with every first print copy, so make sure to get that pre-order in today. Next, we have a brand new trailer. Dim the lights. Yes, that is a release date and a demo coming to the PlayStation 4 this summer. So September 4th for the release date for both PlayStation 4 and Steam for 428 Shibuya Scramble, as well as a playable demo is coming this summer. And we have another new announcement to make. <laughs> Dim the lights again. You know from our collaboration with Mages and 5PB is coming 2019 for PlayStation 4 and Steam. Yeah. So, before we continue, I'd first like to just thank everyone for sitting through as we sped through our uh, Spike Chunsaw <laughs> portion of the panel. But now it's time to bring in <laughs> the legend, <laughs> the man, the myth, my hero, your hero. Kotaro Uchi Goshi! <laughs> so, 
uh, for those of you who might not know who he is, uh, which is no one in this room, right? <laughs> Let's get a little introduction from uh, Ichiko san Oh, and we also have translator Dave. Dave here. Sorry for waiting for me. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I am uh, Kotaro Uchiko Sui. Uh, I am director of this uh, pro project. And at, at, uh, <laughs> <laughs> zero escape series. <laughs> oh, uh, hi guys. Uh, my name is Dave Craker. I'm the manager of our global publishing department over in our Japan home office. And what that means is if Uchikoshi loses his laptop on the airplane or, <laughs> <laughs> or drops his wallet in an Uber, I'm the guy that gets called <laughs> first. So. Dave has his own hashtag, hashtag Dave. Please feel free to use it. Uh, uh, I'm sorry for speaking Japanese. Uh, so I'm going to be doing the rest of the presentation in Japanese. Please excuse me. <laughs> Thank you so much. はい。あの、以前、えっと、プロジェクトシンクということで発表させていただいたタイトルがあるんですけど、それの、え、今回は正式に皆さんにお披露目するえ、ということで、えっと、今回発表させていただきたいと思います。So, I'm I'm sure many of you remember uh uh, last year at GDC, I announced that I'd be working on a new game. Uh, the working title is Project Sync, and since then we've come up with the official project name, which I would like to announce today. Uh, but before that, I'd like to jump right into it and show you the new trailer. Please dim the lights. で、えっと、ま、正式にえっと、プロジェクトシンクということでやってたんですが、正式なタイトルが I know a lot of people have been buzzing on the internet about Project Sync, but just to clear the air, the new name, the new official name for the project is uh I, the Somium files, uh, not AI, but I'll get a bit and uh, what these different uh, keywords mean later in the presentation. で、この物語のまずえっと、舞台なんですけど、えっと、東京で、え、で、え、舞台は東京で、え、時代は、ま、現代なんですけど、ちょっとテクノロジーが発達した現代で、え、そこで、えっと、左目をくり抜かれた死
The game starts out with a bizarre murder case. Uh, a body is found with the left eye has been uh, gouged out of the skull. And you play as a detective on the trail of a serial killer and through the streets of um, modern day Tokyo. Um, it's an adventure game, uh, you know, a, vi a visual novel as you'd come to expect from me. でまず、えー、主人公なんですけれども、えー、っと伊達という刑事が、えー、主人公になっていまして、えー、プ,レイはプレイヤーはその伊達となって、えー、っとさっき言った連続殺人の、えー、謎を追いかけていくことになりますで、えーまあ、一つの特徴として目の色が違うと思うんですけど、えー、彼は左目に、えー、AI が搭載された擬眼をはめていて、えー、その AI の機能を使っていろいろ操作していくというところがまあ一つの特徴になっています。あ、そうです。それが私たちのキャラクター、カナメ・ダテ。彼は、ディテクティブの事件の詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい詳しい advanced technology in his AI eyeball to、uh, solve the crime. で、えー、まあ物語の特徴の方なんですが、えーとまあ、物語というかゲーム全体の特徴なんですけど、えー、と伊達っていうまあ、えー、主人公が容疑者だったり、えー、重要参考人だったりする人たちの、えー、頭の中に入って夢の中に入り込んで。いろんな手がかりを操作していく、えー、見つけ出していくというのが、えー、一つの、えー、ゲームとしての核、まああのー、の部分になっているので、えー、なっていますでそこのその夢のことを、えっと、ラテン語でソムニウムというんですけどなのでこのゲームでは、えっと、夢のことをソムニウムと言っています。Uh, so one of the key features of the game is that、uh, Date is investigating the case. If he finds a key witness or a suspect,、um, you know, people don't always give up information freely. So, what you can do is go in,、uh, Date has the ability to go into their、uh, memories and extract information there. And these memories are kind of like dreamscapes. And、uh, the Latin word for dream is somnium, hence the somnium files. And within the game world, we call these、uh, like、dreamscapes that you go into、uh, somnium. でえー、ともう一回、えー、とタイトルのロゴなんですけど、えー、とタイトルについて、えー、説明したいと思います。えー、と、そう、あ、yep、to kind of、uh, break it all、bring it all together and explain again what the title means。で、まずは、えー、とまあそのままなんですけど、えー、と AI、えーえー、と artificial intelligence、えー、彼の左目に、えー、AI が搭載された擬眼がはめ込まれているので。そこの意味で、えーとまあ、AI を使っていろいろ操作していくということで、えー、その意味の AI という意味がまず込められています。そう、obviously the title can be read like AI is an artificial intelligence.、Uh, that's a reference to the、uh, AI unit in Date's、uh, left eye that he uses to、uh, gather clues and investigate. で、もう一つは、えー、と愛の、えーまあ、同じ発音で、えー、と目という意味の愛。というのがあると思うんですけど、えー、とこの作品のメインテーマが目になっているので、えー、その意味で、えー、同じ発音の愛、AI と書いて愛って読ませることにしました。Right. So the, the letters for the game are AI, but it's actually pronounced I,、uh, is in like eyeball.、Uh, you know, eyes are one of the main themes of the game between the serial killings and also、uh, Date's eye and other things that will be made clear as time goes on. で最後なんですけど、えー、とこれはちょっと日本語になってしまうんですが、えー、と愛っていう発音が日本語だと愛あのラブと同じ意味になるんですけどそういう意味で、えー、とこの作品の物語のテーマとして愛を、えー、いろんな愛を描いている物語になっているのでそのこの,この3つの意味を込めて、えー、AI と書いて愛という、えー、作品のタイトルにしました。And also in Japanese, the word I means love. So it's kind of a, a nice pun play on words there.、Um, in terms of how it plays into the story,、um, love is one of the main themes of the game, and we will explore different types and、uh, expressions of love throughout the story. 
で、えー、とあと,、えー、とサブタイトルのソムニウムファイルズっていうのは、まあ、先ほどご説明した通り、えー、と夢の中に入って操作をするということでそのラテン語のソムニウムというのを使って、えー、ソムニウムファイルズという、えー、サブタイトルを作っています。And in terms of the subtitle of the Somnium files, you know, like we said earlier,、uh, Somnium is Latin for dream. And since you travel into people's、uh, memories and dreams to help solve the case,、uh, that's where that comes from. And in terms of the subtitle of the Somnium files, you know, like we said earlier,、uh, Somnium is Latin for dream. And since you travel into people's memories and dreams to help solve the case, that's where that comes from. えー、キャラルザさんに,お,に、えー、お願いしています、えー、と彼はどういう人かっていうと,、えー、とノーマーヒーローズであったり、えー、任天堂のファイアエンブレムだったり、えー、と最近のポケモン GO の、えー、と人間の方のデザインキャラクターデザインだったりあと映画でいうとアニメ版のゴジラだったりもう本当にいろいろな有名なタイトルを手がけているすごいあの優れたクリエイターなんですけど、えー、彼がキャラクターデザインを担当しています。Uh, so, the character designs are being handled by uh, Yusuke uh, Kozaki. He's a very talented illustrator that I'm, I'm、uh, honored to be able to work with.、Um, you might know him from his work on No More Heroes or the Fire Emblem series.、Uh, he also did the like, trainer designs in Pokemon Go. And most recently, he did the uh, uh, characters for the anime version of Godzilla. So, we're very happy to have him on board. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm not sure. 今回は、えー、と刑事がまあ操作するっていう、えー、とゲームなのでいろんな登場人物が、えー、登場するんですが、えー、登場しますで、まあ、もちろんそれらの全員はほとんど全員、えー、と小崎さんにキャラクターしていただいたんですが、えー、今日は、えー、と今回こ,んこれだけ多くの皆さんにお集まりいただいたので特別にもう一人だけキャラクターを、えー、紹介させていただこうと思います。And、uh, since this is a, a, a detective game,、uh, you know, there's going to be a, a wide cast of characters、uh, involved in the mystery. And originally we had only planned to introduce the main character, but we thought this was a wonderful opportunity. And since we have so many of you guys、uh, that came out to see us today, we'd like to introduce、uh, another one of the main characters. <laughs> えーまあ、彼女なんですけど、えー、イリス、まあ、日本語ではイリスと呼んでいるんですが、イリスという、えー、女の子がいます。で彼女の設定は、えー、18歳の女子高生でネットアイドルをしてまして、まああのえーとそうですね、アメリカではあんまり馴染みないかもしれないですけど、ネットアイドルっていうのは、えー、日本でいうところの歌ってみたとか、踊ってみたとか、あとゲーム実況とかをやっている。<laughs> <laughs> All right, so、uh, this is Iris.、Uh, she's an 18 year old high school student.、Uh, within the confines of the story, she's like, essentially like a YouTuber.、Uh, <laughs> she makes her own like, viral videos where she records herself dancing and singing and things like that. And she also does her own series of Let's Plays. まあ、いろいろ彼女にも、まあ、あのバックグラウンドがあるんですが、まあ、その話は、えー、とおいおい、えー、いろんな場で発表させていただくことにして、えー、今日は、えー、実は彼女からビデオメッセージをもらっているので、えー、とそれを、えー、ご覧いただきたいなと思います。Uh, so this kind of a、like、bright colorful character might seem a bit out of a place in a、uh, grim detective story, but we will go into more detail about her involvement、uh, later on.、Uh, well, Uh, in the future.、Uh, but for today, we do have a special video message from her, so you guys can meet her face to face. プラットフォームについてです。えー、まず、えー、プレイステーション4。So the most important part of the presentation is what platforms will it be available for? <laughs> <laughs> so, 
Uh, obviously, it's coming out for PlayStation 4. <laughs> yes, Steam. And Steam. で、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、その、
One, two, test, 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 cat. 